All right, guys, on today's video, we are back on the PlayStation 2. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to install the Sega Master System and the Game Gear emulator. I'm going to be leaving you two links in the pinned comment. One is going to be for the official download and one's going to be for my own page where you can also get the download. Uh, so first, I'm going to show you the official download page. So PSMS Reload version 0 0.4 by Bruno Freitas. So just scroll down on the page until you find the PSMS Reload uh, slash bin dot zip. So just download the folder. It's going to come in a zip format. You're going to have to unzip it using 7-zip or WinRAR. Um, you can also get the link on my page. So here's my page. Just scroll down. And this is going to tell you everything you need to know about the emulator and what you're going to need. So make sure you have a free McBoot memory card and you launch ELF. Format your USB or HD to FAT32. And then place the PSMS emulator folder on the root of your drive. And then the ROMs in the master system or game gear roms folder in dot sms or dot gg so now i'm going to show you what the folder is going to look like once you unzip it so here's the folder so it's just going to come with the psms.elf which is the uh, emulator itself and then i created two folders one for the Sega Game Gear ROMs and one for the Sega Masters ROMs. So just throw your ROMs in here. Now I'm not going to be providing any ROMs. So that's basically it for the setup of your USB device. Now we're going to get on the PlayStation 2. I'm going to show you how to set it up and a little bit of gameplay. All right, now over on the PlayStation 2. Um, insert your free McBoot memory card and your USB device. Uh, power on your system. So first we're going to launch you launch elf. So just scroll down to you launch elf, press X to load it. It should take you to the file browser. Uh, press circle on the file browser Go down to your mass device Which is your USB press circle Now find your folder. I've created a retro emulators folder on mine So retro emulators circle Now find your folder Sega Masters and Sega Game Gear PSMS emulator circle now we're going to load the psms.elf file, press circle, and that's going to load up the emulator. Now you're going to go to mass, press the X button. Now find your ROMs folder. So mine's going to be the same, so retro emulators. And then psms emulator folder. So here's my ROMs, Sega Game Gear ROMs and Sega Master ROMs. So first I'm going to load up Sega Master's ROMs, press X. So I have three. So first we're going to load up Sonic the Hedgehog 2, press X. And the game should load right up. Now the start button is going to be the X button. So for this emulator, you're going to mostly use the X button and the circle button. Just keep that in mind.
Now to load another game, press the triangle button. Go to exit game, press X. We'll load up Shinobi. Now for this game, you have to use the X button and the square button. Some games might be a little bit different. So now press the triangle. We're gonna load up uh, two Sega Game Gear games. So exit game, go back. Sega Game Gear folder. Let's load up Mortal Kombat. I have not encountered, encountered any um, glitches with any of the games. All the games work perfectly. Let's load up one more. So press the triangle. Exit game. Uh, we'll do Mega Man. And it should load right up. So there you go. That's how you set up the um, Sega Master System and the Sega Game Gear emulator on the PlayStation 2. I will leave both links in the pinned comment. I hope you enjoy the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And on to the next one.